city of festivals do something every month. I mean, you know, it's really amazing. People, I had uh, some people come in today and say, well, now what's Slater doing this month? <laughs> and I said, well, they had uh, uh, the fish splash pool bash. They had movies in the, uh, at the uh, pool. I said they had tractor pool uh, last weekend. This coming weekend is the RC fly-in. It's August 9th. That's where the radio-controlled airplanes come in. And that's really kind of a fun event. Once again, it's free. Uh, these people bring in their radio-controlled airplanes. Some of them are as big or die, you yeah. know, a fourth uh, scale. Uh, one year we had a jet airplane in here, and it sounded like a jet had taken off at KCI. I mean, you never know what's going to show up. It's a free event. You bring in your coolers. I don't know if they're going to have a concession mm -hmm. stand this year. A uh, good concession stand. If you want to learn how to fly one of these airplanes, it's a good time to come because these guys are really good about teaching you. And you'll really see some neat airplanes. It's really a fun event. Uh, we've got uh, bleacher set up out there. Another, like I said, once again, it's a free event. So uh, the City of Festivals doing something again this weekend. I'm, my granddaughter, I'm stuck with her this weekend, so I'm going to bring her out there. And uh, kids love it. It's a good family event. Uh, and it'll, what time do you know what's going to start? Uh, 10 o'clock. 10 o'clock. And uh, it'll be Saturday. Uh, just a lot of fun. And uh, if you're interested in anything like uh, uh, learning how to fly these uh, things, these guys are really good about uh, teaching you and kind of giving you some uh, uh, information on how to get into it. So uh, that'll be August 9th. Streets, uh, Gene hit on that a little bit earlier. Uh, Ian Wayne, our uh, public works uh, superintendent, uh, went over streets. Gene and I went over them today. Uh, if the council has any streets that they think need to be looked at, uh, Gene, did you get that map? Uh, oh, I was waiting on uh, trying to get my number from. All okay. right. So we're looking at, uh, uh, once again, a lot of chip and seal. Uh, that's really worked well. Uh, the uh, another thing we kind of discussed a lot on the intersections. We're going to cut out some sections there and re-asphalt them because uh, rather than redoing the entire street, it seems like the intersections are an issue. One thing also uh, discussed, uh, Gene and I discussed, was Main Street. Eventually, it'll probably have to be addressed. It's going to be a very expensive project. If we do it, it'll probably be, you know, grind it up and overlay it. My thought was is that we do a block at a time, a block each year, because that's all we're probably going to be able to afford to do. So, and and then we we talked about the chip and seal, but then we thought with the chip and seal, bring that into businesses, you know, some of that gravel and everything might cause an issue. So what do you guys think about, say, doing a block of, you know, uh, dig it up, overlay it, but we can only do a block at a time? And, and keep working on other, you know, projects. Yeah, other area. projects, uh, but add that each year, starting next year, doing, you know, one fine. block, and then... I'd rather see that than that chip and Well, side. that's what I'm thinking, yeah. Uh, because it's as good as it works, you don't want it tracked into the uh, businesses. So, what do you think we do? And we, would you figure a block would cost us? Uh, I, I figured about sixteen thousand per block on Main. And it would take us about four years to do all of Main Street. And that, but each year we do it. You know, but you would bring do that, that in, in conjunction with, with the other, other stuff we're doing. Yeah, exactly. exactly. So yeah. that's going to be about a fourth of your budget for the street program for that year. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but eventually we're going to have to address it. So I know, Steve, I think it's a good idea. Yeah, yeah right. but if we do a block a year now, yeah. and it may take us four or five years to get all the Main Street done, but... Uh, well, but that, there's some blocks, and some parts of the blocks are not as, not as heavily traveled. True, I, I agree. You know, uh, and we'll address that, but yeah. I figured if we do it a block at a time rather than the chip and seal, because I don't think that would work for the businesses. It, 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 that you know, so that's what we're looking at starting that maybe next year so